Brian, good, good time to have a chat. No, right. Um, just like to have a quick chat, if that's okay with you. This is my free period. Yeah, I appreciate that, Brian. Uh, sorry, um, but you know, I just thought get some things ironed out. Can it wait? Um, well, Can we do this by email? I'd, no, I'd rather talk about it if that's okay with you. The last few times I've come into your lesson just uh, to make some observations, as you know. Um, yeah, we have spoken about that before, haven't we? Yes. Um, yes, you've made that explicitly clear. Right? I would much rather that you arrange with me before time if you want to visit my students and my class. Like, yes. I like to have my classroom door closed and to to get on with my teaching without interruption or interference. Yes, Brian, but that's kind of the point. Um, the drop-ins are designed for you not to be able to prepare for an observation. Yeah, they're, they're designed to catch people out. Oh, that's not what I said, To catch me Brian, unawares. That's not what I said. We're just trying to raise the bar um, and improve what, what, standards. What does that mean? Well, what do you mean, what mean raise the bar? Well, what kind of management yeah. speak oh, is Brian, that? Brian, um, <laughs> look. There are times where I've come in and um, your performance has been less than outstanding. Right. Can, can I take you back a couple of years? Yes. Janet Morrison? <laughs> yes. Janet Morrison? Yes, she did. Yes, that's right. From the local I, authority. Yes, I have also read that Also an offset yes. inspector. Yes, yes, Brian. She told me that my lesson was the best lesson she had seen. <sighs> yes. And I'm in very, her entire career. Yes, Brian, and right. I'm very pleased that you have received that. Have I not done enough crazy. to show you that I am an outstanding teacher? Yeah. You will remember Brian. also the Ofsted report of six months ago. And this is the point, and this is why I'm talking to you, Brian, is that you obviously have proved yourself uh, quite capable, uh, performing at a quite exceedingly high, capable. outstanding level. Quite capable. Okay, what let's not. That mean? Well, but I have been teaching for 25 years. Yes. over five schools. Yes, you have. Brian? And you're coming to me, talking to me about the quality of my teaching. No, well, yes. Um, what I want to talk to you about is really that some of the observations I've made are there's a sort of a, a, an infrequency of quality. Uh, right. I, I see where this conversation's going. You expect teachers to be outstanding every moment of every lesson. Is that where the management is these days? Well, it, it would be nice. Uh, I'm sure it you'll agree. It would be unbelievable. In, in an ideal world, that would be amazing. We don't world. live in an no, ideal but world, but we do can we? try and achieve it, Brian. Uh, the uh, what are you saying? That I'm not striving to be outstanding? Because I was just thinking, do I need to get Dave in? No, no, not at all, Brian. That's I, you know, the, no, is this Brian, a formal interview? No, I'll have no, my union representative no, here. I, I just, do, do you need me to no, call him? I can do that right now. No, that's well, that, perhaps that's we can not, have this conversation Brian, in front of the principal. Brian, no, that's would you that's like not, to do no, that? No, Brian, this is just an informal chat to to try and say that that I've observed you performing at less than exceptional. And, yeah, and I find your management I, style less than acceptable. Right, no, well, you think, no, I am no, extremely busy. No, this yeah, is my free period. Right, I have an well, enormous amount of marketing yes. to do. 